Hey guys, my name is Josh from the channel Sharpshooter JD, and today I'll be doing some spin throwing for you guys with these awesome homemade throwing spikes that I showed you how to make in a previous tutorial video. Um, I hope to do some throwing from some different distances and some different rotations and maybe even a little bit of uh, target throwing or trick throwing. So it's gonna be a lot of fun and I really hope you guys enjoy. All right guys, I'm just gonna start with single rotation throwing, aiming at the center of this log here. Let's do it. Whoa, that was a good one. Good. <laughs> nice little grouping there. Oh, these are stuck in me. <laughs> All right, I don't know if you guys can see this, but I'm gonna put a little sticker on this second log and uh, see if I can hit it. Yeah. All right, sticker right here. See if I can skewer it with a spike. <laughs> well, that was one heck of a group, all high though. Hope you guys can see this. I can't quite tell on camera if you can or not, but it's right here, right in the center. Ah! Oh, I got it. I didn't skewer it though. Give it one more try. try again later from the other perspective maybe you guys can see it better all right I'm gonna try two full spin two half spin now sweet first try that was easy what about underhand Try that again, that actually worked better than I thought it would. This is uh, underhand half spin. Woo! -hoo -hoo -hoo. Three out of four. That's pretty good. I'm really bad at, at uh, underhand, so I'm, I'm pleased with that. All right, let's try underhand. What am I going to do? Underhand. All right. Let's try underhand. Full spin, full spin, half spin. See if that works. Ah, oh, so close. All right, let's try that again. Underhand, full spin, full spin, half spin. Ah, that 
was terrible. But I got it. So I can do the same thing a little bit quicker. There we go. That was better. He's barely stuck though. Let's give it one more shot. Then I'll scoot back a little bit, move the camera. All right, underhand, full spin, half spin. <laughs> oh well, one more. Oh no. Okay, that was good enough. This one would have stuck, but hit the out of that one. All right, I'm gonna give this sticker one more shot. Then we'll move back. Keep saying one more try and I really don't mean it. <laughs> I mean one more try if I get it. <laughs> ah. This is hard guys. You other knife throwers out there, you gotta try this. This is tough. I think this is like a like a two inch, two inch paper dot. Shouldn't be that hard, but it really is. Ah! Yes! Yes! Oh my gosh. That is so perfect. You guys gotta see this. Look at that. <laughs> awesome. So there you go, a little bit of homemade spike throwing. Really hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys are interested in learning how to make some of these spikes for yourself, I will have a link on the screen now that will take you to an article I just wrote that gives you some really great step-by-step -step instruction on how to make these spikes a couple of different ways depending on the tools and equipment that you have access to. So I go over how to forge them and how to make them with a bench grinder or even a file. Lots of great information on there, so go check that out. And I will have a link to the original video on how to make these things linked in that article as well if you guys prefer to watch. So yeah, go check that out. If you guys like what you see, please consider subscribing to my newsletter. You'll find the subscription form at the bottom of that article. And through that newsletter, I'll be giving you guys updates on when new videos are coming out and when new articles are going to be posted and much, much more. So please consider subscribing to that. It really helps me out. I really appreciate it. And I really think you guys are going to enjoy the content that I will be posting. And if you enjoyed this video, make sure to leave me a like or a comment down below. And if you guys haven't already, make sure you subscribe to my channel and make sure you hit that bell icon so that you never miss an upload. As always, thank you so much for watching. I hope you all have a wonderful rest of your day and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.